living in the Redondo Beach Golden Hills. A lot of people want to be here, and I tell you why. The location is amazing, it's central to everything, a lot of single family houses, and you're close to a lot of great schools, freeways, not that far from LAX, and of course those wonderful beaches. One of the reasons the Golden Hills is so desirable is because it's just south of Manhattan Beach. Many homes were actually further west than the homes of Manhattan Beach, and it's just east of Hermosa Beach. Now, those cities are much more expensive, and your lifestyle is gonna be about the same. So who doesn't want that? There's great value in the Golden Hills. Most of the homes in the Golden Hills are what we call tall and skinny. That's because they're tall and they're skinny. They're on 2,500 square foot lots. The one I'm gonna show you is not a typical Golden Hills property. The house is much larger at almost 2,400 square feet and it has five, count them, five bedrooms on three different levels and it's been totally updated and remodeled. Let's go take a look. So here we are at 1600 Wallacott Street in Redondo Beach, California. And as you look around, you may have thought you were in a New York City loft or a Miami penthouse. This place combined beach chic with loft urban contemporary style living. You know, I've been in a lot of tall and skinnies in Redondo Beach. This place, this upstairs great room is huge. You're not going to find something else like this. And because it's a corner lot, you're flooded with sun, and you can see Palos Verdes to the south, the mountains to the north, and on a really clear day, you can see the city of LA. This kitchen has been totally opened up and remodeled. Great countertop, great backsplash. These are new cabinets, not old ones that have been repainted. And be at the kitchen sink and see the views. So before we go downstairs, I want to tell you what the floor plan is going to be. And you can always go to my website, ellisposner.com. Look under the My Listings tab and you'll see this property with this very video. And you'll also see a Matterport 3D walkthrough so you can get a better idea as well as a floor plan. So we're on the top level right now. This is what's called in Redondo Beach a reverse floor plan. There is one bedroom up here, which I'm gonna show you. And when you go downstairs to the level you come in on or where the garage is, there's two more bedrooms and a full bath. And then you go down another flight of stairs and there's two more bedrooms. That equals five by my count. Now, one of the bedrooms at the lowest level has had the wall removed, so now it's more of a media room, but this property in the tax records is a five bedroom with three baths. From the very lowest level, you go out into a small kind of patio type of backyard that's kind of cool, we'll get down there and I'll show it to you, but that's what we're gonna see. Hey, let's go look at the primary bedroom now. So uh, this is the main level where you come in nice double doors and the detached garage is right over there. And there's two bedrooms on this level plus a full bathroom. So as we come down to the lowest level, which is really what makes this property unique, there's two more bedrooms down here. Again, as I mentioned, one is being used as a media room, the wall has been removed, and there's a full bath, and you can exit out to the small backyard. Oh, hey, sorry, I was just on the phone. Um, if you like these kind of property tours, if you're interested in 
Redondo Beach, the South Bay Beach cities who want to learn more about living in Redondo Beach, then subscribe, hit the like button, hit the notification button. I'm always posting with a lot of information and really cool videos you won't find elsewhere.